Since the announcement of his ex-wife Giselle Bündchen's pregnancy, Tom Brady had not made many public statements outside of football until he held up a card in an Instagram story on Tuesday. This card featured a well-known phrase from former President Theodore Roosevelt, specifically titled, The Man in the Arena. If the title seems familiar, it's because the ESPN Plus documentary about Brady's life that aired in 2021 and 2022 had that exact title. The message's timing suggests that Brady is teasing Bunchen's pregnancy with Joaquin Valente, her new partner. The message opens with the words, It is not the critic who counts. It is not the man who points out where the strong man stumbles or where the doer of deeds could have done them better. The credit goes to the man who is in the arena, whose face is covered in blood, sweat, and dust, who strives heroically, who makes mistakes and fails repeatedly because no effort is complete without mistakes and failures. However, who genuinely tries to carry out the actions, who is aware of the great passions and devotions, and who dedicates himself to a worthy cause, who at best knows the triumph of great achievement in the end, and who at worst, if he fails, at least fails while daring greatly, so that his place shall never be with those cold and timid souls who know neither victory nor defeat. After 11 years of marriage, Bunchen and Brady got divorced in October 2022. Together, the two have a 14-year-old son named Benjamin and an 11-year-old daughter named Vivian. Since the New England Patriots legend's eldest child, 17-year-old Jack, was born after dating actress Bridget Moynihan, Bunchen will have three children, matching Brady's total. Bunchen enrolled in Valente's jiu-jitsu classes in 2021, which led to their first encounter.